soaking off my old nail polish. Guys, all know I'm super into like nail stuff. And I just thought, how cute would it be to go to Japan and get Japanese style nails? Because I feel like I'm really into the Asian aesthetics, like the cutesy stuff. Like for example, this top right here, it's all like, yeah, Asian cutesy style. So I was like, okay, let's get some cute nails. So I found this person online. Her name is Ri. Her uh, salon name is called Pinky. And I made a reservation a month in advance. And she is located in Shibuya and pretty much like a one minute walk from the Shibuya station. For confidential reasons, I will link her social media down below. Okay. Do you know what you're gonna do? That one right there. Mm. Many selections, okay. but look at all these beautiful sets. Oh. Wow. This one looks so cute, ready for Christmas time. But look at all these variety of Christmas designs here too. So excited. Very cute. <laughs> Very cute. So yeah, I saw like on the website that you're doing like cow gel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, is this like a Japanese type of thing? Because yeah, I've never Jap heard of uh, that in the it's US. It's Japanese gel, kind of soak of gel. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. It's a very natural product mm -hmm. and uh, very gentle for nails. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. Okay. I guess I have a question. Like, yeah. you like manually buff the gel off? Because like you don't use like a drill. I'm just uh, curious. Sometimes I use. Oh, okay. But basically, I like this. Oh, you like it? It's a, um, not healthy for drills. Oh, uh, okay. It's some burning. Right. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. That's why. Yeah. That, yeah. yeah. Very different because like though in yeah, US, I always, always use the drills. So I was like, yeah, oh, yeah. okay, you're I have drills. Uh -huh. but, yeah. Usually. For, yeah. Oh, okay. Soaking off my old nail polish. Now for design time. Mm -hmm. After clipping, filing, and buffing my nails, Rie proceeded to put on the base coat with a clear gel. After applying the clear gel, she completely painted two of my fingers with two layers of a sheer white color. With my remaining three fingers, she mixed two shades of white and painted a layer to only the lower half of the nail. With the three fingers that only have the lower half of the nails painted, Rie applied a thin layer of glue on a flat brush and dabbed some gold and white circle flakes. She applied them at the border where the white and the clear part of the nails intersected to smooth the junction. She then proceeded to delicately add a couple of gold stars to the mix of circle flakes. sample is this way, uh -huh. but I can flip it yeah. the other side, mm -hmm. I see. Which do you like? Um, this? Probably yeah, to the outside. Mm -hmm. Other way, yeah, okay. that way. To one of the fingers that was fully painted white, she applied non-white gel to a fine brush and outlined a Christmas tree for the base of the chrome powder. These like base gel or yeah, it's non-white gel. Non-white yes. gel. Oh, I see. After curing it once, she used resin gel to outline the Christmas tree again. Rie then used an eyeshadow applicator and applied a gold chrome powder to the shape of the Christmas tree. She cleaned the surrounding area with alcohol before applying non-wipe gel and curing it. To the other finger that is fully painted white, 
she applied Legend gel. using a fine brush to outline a small bow. Afterwards, she used an eyeshadow applicator and applied a gold chrome powder to the shape of the 3D bow. She cleaned the surrounding area with alcohol before applying non-wipe gel and curing it. She also applied a tiny gold bead to the center of the bow. On the finger with the Christmas tree design, she added a gold star to the top of the tree. Afterwards, she moved on to embellishing the tree with different ornaments. She used a variety of silver and gold rhinestones and pearls to decorate the tree. To the finger with the bow, she applied glue in a wreath shape and decorated it with gold and silver rhinestones, pearls, and beads all around. I really appreciated how Rie took her time in the entire decorating process to be as detail-oriented as possible. Lastly, to seal everything in, Rie applied the top coat. Guys, I just finished my nails. Oh my god, these are so cute. Look at this. It's like little gold Christmas design set. Some stars, some sparkles, and chrome, and Christmas light, and pearls, and a wreath. Like, I am just girling out right now because, you know, I love Asian fashion, Asian aesthetics, cute kawaii, and this is like, Wow, so good. And she is so fast too. She did it in less than two hours. Hour and 45 minutes, I believe. She had like a whole display of Christmas designs to choose from. I just chose one and it was such a nice, very comfy living room. I sat in a big chair, as you can see. And then it was really warm. They got the TV on. Yeah, Ri was so nice. And in terms of like money-wise, this was approximately 18,900 yen. I also had like my previous gel nail polish removed too so i believe that was like a thousand one hundred so yeah in u.s dollars it's approximately 120 u.s dollars i'm so excited yay it's gonna be a girly and cute